Welcome Royals to what I'm affectionately calling Purple Rain. Sit back, relax, and enjoy the spring refresh of my living room tour. Enjoy! All right, guys, so today I'm going to do something a little different. I'm actually going to do a walkthrough tour with you on the living space. I get so many questions about this room, about where various things come from, and I figured this would be a great time to share or show and tell where everything came from in this space. As you can see, my color for the spring season is what I'm calling purple rain. I decided to go with the color of the year, the peri, very peri, and I coupled it with just various shades of purple to give interest and dimension. And so here, I'm starting with my entryway table, credenza, buffet, whatever you wanna call it. But this is what that looks like, starting from the top, you guys. The glittered 
wall art is from Ross. I love it. It has various shades of grays, taupes, and it picks up a little bit of those purple hues in it, and I am loving it. So I placed that there in the center. My lamps are from Home Goods. Beautiful mercury glass with a little bit of a gold undertone, which I like. On the table, I have a vase here, also from Home Goods. Floors are from Hobby Lobby. All of them are from Hobby Lobby. No, I'm correction. Um, there is a bushel in here from Amazon. Moving down, I have this beautiful bowl or plate that I picked up also from Home Goods. The floral or greenery inside is from Hobby Lobby. This purple lamp candle is from Home Goods. Coffee table books or styling books are from Amazon and they pick up the purple hues perfectly. This little terrarium slash lantern is from Ross or TJ Maxx and I just use it for functionality to add our keys and to tie in with the whole greenery or succulent of it all. I just added a succulent pick on top to give it a nice different look and the actual buffet itself is a basset piece. I got it off of Facebook Marketplace. Brand new still in the box guys. It was a still of a deal but I love that it has a little bit of a champagne gold hue that picks up on the lamps perfectly. So that is the entryway. Swing it around now to another most asked about item. It is my bar cart, guys. This Parisian style bar cart is from Amazon, and I will have it linked as well. All of the adornments on top, starting from the top, guys. Of course, I got to coordinate. So, Stella on deck, honey. I love me some Stella Rosa. Some of this is alcoholic and non alcoholic beverages for those that choose not to drink when they come over. So, on top, I have the stemless champagne flutes from. That one is actually from Ross. That's not the, it's the Z Gallery Duke, but it looks very similar. And then I have the decanter from Z Gallery. Two wine glasses there from Ross and my Stella Rosa, wherever Stella Rosa is sold. On the second tier, I have some little um, whiskey glasses with the gold rhinestone embellishment and another bottle of Stella because it coordinates down at the bottom just some more adult beverages and beautiful votives that I picked up from Ross and the rum chata set came from one of my local spirits spirit stores so that is that moving up on the top guys got these two circular um, wall pieces from home goods I love that soft gold I think it's beautiful and the wall art in the middle is from Burlington I've had that for several years those wall pieces, I'm sorry, I didn't tell you what a lot of the things cost, but um, the circular pieces were $39.99. The wall art was $29.99. If I can think of the prices, guys, I'll mention it, but if not, if I can link it, I'll link it. The, starting with my Cutler chair slash love seat, it is actually a Racklin furniture piece, this entire set, let me pan over. The entire set is by a company called Racklin. They sell high-end, um, luxury furniture pieces. It was a originally in a bronzy gold color and I just had it reupholstered for this nice grayish velvet and it is a high performance velvet so I can simply wipe it off if anything gets on there which I absolutely love and I dressed them up a bit by adding these acrylic feet to them. I don't know if you can see that but they came with just a regular wood feet but I added those acrylic feet just to give it a little bit more of that Hollywood glam look and feel so on top of the on this sofa or love seat i have two metallic pillows that are from tj maxx they tie in beautifully with the sofa and they're nice neutral so any color i choose to style with pops off of it as you can see here the pillow is from z gallery as well as the oslo throw i will have those items linked i think these pillows from tj maxx have been they're not whether well, I'm not saying they just discontinued, but they're no longer this from TJ Maxx, so I can't link it. But they are by Callisto Home, if I'm not mistaken. Moving over to my um, coffee tables, so I'll pan over to both of them. They are from Ashley's. So I absolutely love the champagne and mirrored style of them. I didn't want everything to be matchy matchy, but I did want the coffee tables to match. So I got those from Ashley's. I got a floor sale deal, so I was happy about that. And on top, I have a lamp from Home Goods. I have it adorned with some wedding pics from Hobby Lobby. 
a nice little mercury glass votive there, a base there from Home Goods, and a lavender wreath from Hobby Lobby. Okay, guys, moving over to the sofa. Pillows here are a combination of the two from the Love Seat, the Callisto Home Pillows, the Z Gallery, and the Oslo Throw. The solid purple pillows are from Amazon as well as the inserts inside. I will have those linked. The three pictures in the center is from Home Goods. I think they were $29.99, but you know with Home Goods, I can't link it. So that's that. These wall sconces, I get a lot of questions about these wall sconces, guys. And let me tell you my devastation. You notice this one has a beautiful votive on top. And up until five minutes ago, so did that one. I took them down to give them a nice refresh. They were a champagne hue, and I wanted to go with a warm gold just to give a little bit more dimension and depth to them. And the Holy Spirit told me to make sure that that was secure. I put it up there in anticipation to go ahead and start recording. And as soon as I turned my back, the voter fell off. It was glued down. I guess the nail inside was not as secure or either the hook wasn't all the way on there. All I know is it came crashing down. The voter broke. So I'm on the hunt now for um, another set because I'm sure I'm not going to find that top voter because it did not come on the actual candelabra. I added that on there. So I'm sure I won't find that, but I will be on the lookout for another set. But I still love the um, candelabras themselves. They are from Hobby Lobby. They came in a like a bronze color or like a brown metal. And I just painted them to give them a nice Hollywood glam look. And the same on this coffee table, guys. It is from Ashley's lamp is from home goods and i have just a mercury glass wax warmer from walmart and so now moving down to the coffee table this coffee table is a basset piece as well a person just from overstock when they had a either 20 percent or 15 percent off sale and i love it i love the oval shape of the kidney shape of it i think it picks up the curvature in my sofa i don't know if you guys can see that because a lot of you say that I have so many pillows that you can't see it, but I like the pillow, so mind your business. So you see it has like a nice kidney shape to it. So I thought that this oval coffee table would pick up the curves of that beautifully, and it does. So I'm happy with that. On the coffee table, I have a set of candles, probably my favorite candles. If you've been a royal um, family member for any length of time, you will know that these are, and also in... Uh, flea market fine. I absolutely love them. I got the entire set for $15. I love it. On top, I have some lavender candles from Hobby Lobby, 50% off, of course. The floral piece, you guys, is a DIY by yours truly with a combination of pigs from Hobby Lobby and Amazon. And I just added some nice succulents to give that nice spring vibe. The vase that's holding it is from Tuesday morning. In the center, I have a actually a cake plate with the gold is by Godinger and I love it. It's so gorgeous. And I just have out on top some coasters because we need functionality as well as a cute little blessed sign because that's what I am, y'all. I'm so blessed and so are you. So I have that there. Moving over, guys. The window treatments. I get a lot of questions about my window treatments. They are from Home Goods. They are by, I want to say Tahari Home. They are the 108 length. So gorgeous. I don't know if I can get a good because I have the windows open but so so pretty they're almost identical to the pillows that i have on the sofa so i love that the curtain rod is a mercury glass rod beautiful um ornate rod i got from tuesday morning moving down now to uh -oh, to um the what is this called um ginger jar I saw this ginger jar. I came in like a bubblegum pink, which was pretty, but I knew I wanted to give it a nice glam over. So I just gave it a nice um, champagne mist spray paint and I love it. So it just sits there in the center. Moving over now to this area, another little sitting area I created. I have this gorgeous Lena mirror from Home Goods. I love the mercury glass accents around it. And then there's the mirror in the top. So pretty, not mercury glass. It is the antique mirror that's it's trimmed in. So I thought that was absolutely gorgeous. And it really picks up on my buffet, which is from Bassett and my coffee table. So they perfectly complement each other. Moving down, two more lavender pillows from 
Amazon and this beautiful adorn pillow I picked up from Home Goods. This bench, you guys, I get a lot of questions about this bench. I picked it up from an estate sale in my area off of Facebook Marketplace. Got an amazing deal on that. It's perfectly trimmed in the um, antique mirror as well. So, and oh, not let me not forget the infamous rug. I get so many questions about this rug, guys. The rug is from Inspire Me Home Decor. And I'm not sure if it's still available. If it is, I will have it linked in my description box. But, oh, and also the ottomans that are sitting here just to create more seating. They are from Inspire Me Home Decor. And I do have decor housed inside. So they are pretty and functional as well. So, guys, that is it. That is the details of this room from top to bottom. And I hope you guys enjoyed this different type of tour for me. But I felt like I need to take the time out and give you guys just a detailed tour because so many ask and a lot of times I don't tell that in the video so hope you enjoy it if you are new here hit that subscribe button become a member of the royal family we would love to have you as you can see we are full of inspiration motivation and so much creativity and we would love to have you come along and be a part of this royal journey if you are not already connected with me on my other social media platforms, I can be found at Royalty Designs with Trevina on Instagram, Facebook, and TikTok. Also, guys, shop my Amazon store. You will find some beautiful items in there to style your home. As well as find some other functional items to clean your home. So I have a couple of stores there, a cleaning store, a storage organization store, as well as home decor. So that is it. That is all guys. I want you all to stay safe, remain royal. And until the next video, have yourself a blessed and most beautiful, beautiful day. Bye.